as we look at the evolution of ORAN over the next five years, I think not only will we see proving out of technology models and a technology ecosystem, but I think one of the most exciting changes will be the SI ecosystem that we see emerging that really brings together the best of cloud and lifecycle management and automation and core network technology skills. That's what will accelerate adoption and innovation. And so when we see ORAN, early deployments of ORAN, first there's, there's kind of proving out the architecture and the technology models. And, and so the, particularly the ISVs um, are getting a, you know, a, a lot of attention on how they can scale and perform. What we're also seeing is the emergence of, of a different, more systems integration based model as you start to look for things like end-to-end -end automation application integration, application aware networks in the radio access network. It takes on a whole new um, remit for what have been traditional SI approaches. Three areas that we're really focused on investing where I, where I think we can bring a lot of value to the, um, to the industry. One is having an open hybrid cloud um, architecture based on Red Hat, which allows operators really to to regain control of their business and their architecture and deploy services wherever they need to run. Um, the other thing is then on top of that, we, we announced or launched a, a telecom industry cloud with us with a 35 plus ecosystem partners that are all about bringing a level of industry specific or telco specific security, automation, AI capabilities on top of that hybrid cloud platform, which will drive the automation integration interoperability and also provide a level of application management and integration that will allow the telcos to more readily monetize their 5G platforms. Uh, so open hybrid cloud platform and ecosystem and um, middleware uh, stack that can be deployed by operators in whatever technologies they choose in their RAN. And then the third thing really is, is we, uh, we announced recently a global 5G and network uh, services practice with deep industry skills and, and domain expertise to help operators deploy ORAN technologies. We opened up a ORAN center of competence in Madrid where we plan to hire more than 500 services professionals over the next three years. And then we'll test out those use cases and technologies in our, um, in our innovation labs in, in Dallas and in Nice.